Jan is here today to uh, give us a little presentation about uh, positive uh, thinking, positive attitude. So, Jan. <laughs> All right, good morning, everybody. Good morning. And uh, so, hi, my name is uh, Jan Dober, and I'm very excited to be here today to share with you my outlook on life. Uh, I would like to thank you very much for the opportunity of being here today, as I feel that Mercy Care and I share similar values and principles. Now, as you can tell, I have an accent, so in case somebody do not understand what I'm saying, please raise your hand and I repeat myself. Takže teďko budu mluvit česky a budu čekat na to. Well, at least we know who is paying attention. Anyway, I'm from uh, Czech Republic, which is right in the middle of the Europe. And I, I have been in the United States since uh, 1998. And I do work for my uncle Martin, who owns Martin's Restaurant on the corner of 73rd Avenue North and Ocean Boulevard, right next to Starbucks, <laughs> past 20 years. That's why I also I'm known as the nephew. <laughs> I would like to start uh, today with uh, Mercy Care's vision, which is to provide our communities with the experience that every day is a gift. And I was looking online what is mercy and hospice and palliative care and um, all I could get out of it is that uh, your goal is to improve the quality of life of patients and families and all of you who work here are very compassionate at what you do. So I will share with you my provision and my pro values that are on these little cards that I give everybody. And, um, <laughs> I will start at uh, on uh, September 17, 2009. I have become citizen of the greatest country in the world, the United States of America. <laughs> and uh, as, when I got sworn as a citizen, I really felt that the gate of opportunity opened and I knew I'm gonna have a joy and happiness in my life. Shortly after I became citizen, I have become the member of the Grand Strand Optimist Club. And uh, through the Grand Strand Optimist Club, I met uh, many organizations like Mercy Care and, other, and uh, many individuals who make real difference in our communities. Through the Optimist Club, I also uh, learned that uh, it's really important to read and learn all the time. So I did start reading and learning every day. And, uh, through my reading, I learned that uh, in order to have success in life, one has to have values and principles. So I created my own pro, or my own pro values and my own provision, which is to give every day is living, which for me is that I give joy to myself every day through living my pro values. And my pro values are First pro value is love to live. And it's all about loving yourself, love every moment of your life, and love every second of your life, even the first one. And uh, love yourself. When you love yourself, you are able to share love with other people, the most important people around you, family, or friends, and all the people you come in contact with. Uh, when you love every moment of your life, no matter what you do, love it. When you brush your teeth, love it. When you wash dishes, love it. When you play and have fun, love it. Uh, the first pro value reminds me saying, how you do anything is how you do everything. So whatever you do in life, just do the best you can, the best of your knowledge and the best of your ability. And that is the shortest shortcut you can take in life. The next pro value, is uh, influence attitudes, mind first. And we all heard it many times that attitude is everything. Uh, the question is, what is the right attitude? Well, the answer is positive attitude. <laughs> the next question is, how to have positive attitude? Well, uh, my idea is, when you start saying yes instead of no, 
you start saying and instead of but, and you start saying when instead of if, you will have real positive life without excuses. And speaking of yes and excuses, that is why I'm here. Through my reading and learning, I heard that uh, in order to be really successful and really grow, one should uh, set up 10 lunches with 10 people that uh, you really admire, they inspire you, you really appreciate for what they do and who they are, and you really respect them. So on May 15, 2012, I had a lunch with uh, Sarah Faucher, and uh, I shared with her my pro values and what we talk about today. And a few days after our lunch, I went on my annual visit to Czech Republic. And when I came back, I received a note from Sarah saying, uh, thank you that uh, she received a phone call from a friend asking her to go to Paris, France. And uh, she was thinking of all the excuses and all the no's she could say uh, not to go. And then she thought about our lunch and she said yes. She went to Paris, France, and she had the greatest time in her life. The next pro value is voice myself. You know, uh, human mind is the most powerful tool in the universe. Look around you what a human mind created. This fan, this, this uh, screen, this table, this tie, this cup, these glasses, this uh, tablecloth, this picture. Everything has been created by a human mind. So. Your mind is using your voice to ex express itself. So what you say really matters. The words you choose have tremendous influence on your life. That's why I like to choose words that give joy in life. For example, when you see me, you say, how are you? And I say, I'm outstanding. And I put smile on your face. The next pro value is exercise mind and body. Uh, your body is here to stay with you for the rest of your life. So when you exercise your body, you feel great about yourself, you feel confident, and you love yourself. Uh, just like your body, your mind needs exercise in order to grow. And you are all experts in many different fields. And in order to stay experts, you have to exercise your mind, your mind so you can keep uh, fulfilling your goal, which is to improve the quality of life of your patients and their families. The next pro value is uh, improve results continuously. And for me, it was the realization of a lifetime commitment to my pro values. You know, no matter what situation you are in life, whether you are up or you are down, you are a winner or you are a loser or you fail, you can always improve. Japanese have a word for continuous improvement. It's Kaizen, which is about improving 10 to a percent every day. And it has a great influence, great impact on your life over the long period of time. Uh, uh, one way to improve yourself is always do extra. When you, without hesitation, just do extra. This reminds me of uh, one saying, it's uh, called, do not take anything personally, because only you know yourself 100%. So what other people think and what other people say about you has nothing to do with you. So always do the best you can and always do what is right. And now the last pro value and my favorite is uh, trust and time are on my side. You know, trust is the essential key to every relationship and relationship is your life. How do you feel when you are around a person that you can really trust? Time is uh, equal for all of us and time goes always the same speed. Time is on my side because I'm here today talking with you about my pro values. And we all determine the value of our own time. We spend every day, every month, every year, every decade, our entire life. Uh, the biggest value of my time 
is uh, to living my pro values and completing them every day. And uh, together, my pro values are part of a team, live it. Just like you are part of the team, and uh, you all individually play very important role on the Mercy Care team, and only together you can keep fulfilling your vision, and only together by individually doing the best possibly you can, you can achieve your ultimate goal, which is the joy and happiness of your patients and families. Thank you very much. Very You're welcome. Wow. I want to say, too, most of you know um, Jan. He comes here and shreds for us. And I said to him um, one day, I said, you know, Jan, would you like to do something that's, you know, maybe a little more, I don't know, more up to your talents and whatnot? He said, no, no, said, uh, I love doing the shredding. I love doing things that other people don't like to do. So I, so I can do them. And he said, you know, it's a great time for me because I don't have to think. I just do it. And he said, I get to talk to all these wonderful people here at Mercy. Isn't that wonderful? Yes. Yeah. Well, speaking of the shredder, you know, I, come, I said, I'm going to do this for one year. So after about a year, you know, almost before the end, end was the year was end, I said, well, you know, let me go one more year. And I'm really glad I did it because after about uh, 14, 15 months, I finally learned how the shred works. <laughs> what, what, what all those, what all those three buttons mean? <laughs> and yesterday I was here and I learned new function about the shredder again. <laughs> so thank you. Thank you. And I'm going back to work. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you.